You ran directly into danger, Hunter. And Oglyph attacked you. You're lucky to be alive right now. You're welcome to join the rest of us at dinner in the dining hall. Avalon's nothing more than a piece of shit filled with his own intentions. He's a murderer. Someone help me! Sarah would still be alive if it weren't for Avalon. You're a terrible keeper, Avalon, and I hope you die in the darkness right alongside Demetrius! You've done a lot of fucked up things, but I see the way that you look at Hunter. I don't believe you would do anything to hurt him. I never trusted that piece of shit from the start. Don't you guys see how he is with Hunter? He's nothing but a control freak. He's done nothing wrong, please! He has to be innocent! You need to do something about the angry mob. I'm doing what I can. Zero paid a visit. He said that the water's disappearing towards the gate. I need you to help me find a weakness in the Ogres. I believe they're the stem of the problem. Once we kill them, the Bunty should return to normal. Are you two fighting? What? No, Excuse no, me? no, no, never. Avalon! <sighs> what? Leave. I think Demetrius corrupted you into a monster. Much worse than the Oglips. Rowan? <laughs> Cronus? Why don't you take him back home? Isn't that what he really wanted? I tried, and... and... <laughs> it... he... we... I'm lost. Do you need a place to sleep tonight? I will always hate fishing. <laughs> Honestly, same. It's too wet. Thank you! It sucks. I don't understand why you like it so much, Dee. It's not a matter of liking or disliking it, but rather a matter of coming to enjoy the moment. Ugh, here you go again with this philosophical stuff. When will you stop? Well, I think it's refreshing. Gives some pretty good insight. Wait. What's wrong? Shh. We can't stay here. How long is it going to be like this until we... Until we die? Wait! We're gonna die? Both of you need to be quiet unless you'd like to die today. Follow me. Oh, Kenyon! <laughs> Thank you.
you guys had a fight. Remember? Yeah. Are you sure this is a good idea? He can take care of himself. Oh. And what about Rowan? It'll be fine. Boy, Where are you going? going? On the path until you get to the building. It'll look right down. <sighs> well, because it is. Look, I think it's pretty clear by now that it'll be fine. He'll have to get over it. Get over it? What the hell is going on? He's doing me a favor. With what? Your stupid oglyph fantasies? Oh, let's go find the oglyphs and why they're here, where they came from, and be the heroes that we're not. Don't talk to her like that! Hey! You know as well as I do that if we don't put these damn things in check, we'll be in checkmate. Hunter, can we just talk... alone? No. Hunter, are you hearing yourself? Hey, knock it off. He's wanting to go, so let him go. He only wants to go because you talked him into it. And why shouldn't he go out and explore the damn world he controls? He's a fractured wing and a concussion for Christ's sake. <sighs> right. All right? This still needs to happen. He still needs to go. Go where? Hunter, please. Let's just talk about this. He's going to speak with Solstice. What? How insane are you? Do you even understand the risk you're putting him in? It's not that big of a deal. Excuse me? I mean, sure, it's kind of a big deal, but- No, he's not going. Stop dictating his life. He's 18 years old, and not to mention, an upcoming king. You, on the other hand, are nothing more than a- Uh- a pest. A pest! Alright, that's enough! <laughs> uh... Look. I'm still going. You can't stop me, but if you want to, I'll let you come. That's it. You're not gonna throw me around or control me. Got it? I'm sorry. Well, then... Are you sure you don't want water for the trip? You said we'd be following a river. Purest river in existence. It doesn't even need to be filtered. Alright. And it's... Solus? <sighs> Solstice. If anyone knows why the Oglyphs are here, it's gonna be her. But isn't Avalon the all-knowing wisdom keeper? <laughs> he might know it's for breakfast, but that's about it! <laughs> I think it's best you two get going. I wish you nothing but the best of luck. And if you come across another one of those suckers... Stab it in the heart for me, would you? Oh dear god. It's not like we'll live if we come across one. Yeah. Thanks. And Hunter? Be safe. They're as dead as Damien himself. <sighs> Don't say such a thing. Give them a chance. <laughs> no, he's right. They're dead.
Hunter, are you sure you want to do this? I'm not a kid. I never said you were. You're sure acting like I'm one. Hunter, I'm just really worried. I mean... <sighs> Rowan, it's fine. If you're such a fucking wuss, you're more than welcome to go back. Uh, 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 Look, just give me a chance. What's it gonna take for me to prove myself to you that I'm more than capable of taking care of myself? Well? I'm sorry, I mean it, you're right, you're a crone keeper, I shouldn't be hovering over you, you know what you need best, please, I, I just, I'm worried Hunter, I'm worried about you, your well being, I don't want to lose you. Why do you think you're going to lose me? Well, for starters, Demetrius wanted to kill you, practically just because he could, then you got attacked by the Oglyph, and, and now you're walking in Oglyph territory. Hunter, this is too much. What am I supposed to do if I lose you to one of those things? What if Demetrius gets out of his cell? What if Solstice gets loose? Rowan, that's not gonna happen. But Hunter! <sighs> Rowan, let's be real. Just for a minute. How many years have I been going to that cave? I don't know. How should I know? Rowan, bear with me. <sighs> I've been going since I was like 15. How old am I now? 18. Right. How many months are in a year? Twelve? How many years have I been going to that stupid cave? Two? No. Three. Now, do some multiplying. Three times twelve. Thirty-six. Right. So I've gone to that stupid cave 36 times. I've had to fight for my life against you in your freaky werewolf form 36 times. But what about the times you skipped? Fine, Rowan. Let's get technical. I probably missed five moons over the course of three years, but I'll even give you an extra one and just say 30. I still fought for my life against you, 30 times. Then I fought a psychotic bastard and survived being killed by something that supposedly killed everyone else before me. Whoa. You're right. I shouldn't have to worry about you. Are you good now? As long as you are. I am. Come on. I've got a mile to walk. Hey, Hunter. Mm. <laughs> Can we sort over? Rowan, I don't think there's any- hey, <laughs> what do you think you're doing? <gasps> oh god. Oh, it can't.
can't be. Wow, it's so great to see you and you. <laughs> wow, the almighty king. It's such a shame that Avalon replaced the righteous ruler, Demetrius, with such a... a peasant like yourself. And I assume you're the solstice I was told about. Moi? <laughs> no, really? You guys still talk about me. I would have assumed my legacy died with Demetrius. Jesus. <laughs> yeah, and I would have assumed someone would have told me how annoying you were, but I guess here we are. <laughs> Pitiful. You just can't stand to recognize true humor, my dear. Um, but nevertheless, what brings you two to my <laughs> lovely, humble abode? From my understanding, you know why we're here. I do. Just tell me. <laughs> Sorry. Can't help you if I don't even know why you're here. The Oglyph's Solstice. The O what? Solstice. Wow, he speaks. I was starting to wonder if someone hit the mute button on him for a minute there. Cut to the fucking chase. Ugh, you're no fun. Pitiful, huh? You know, I'm not gonna lie to you. After all, I'm not that type, but you didn't need to come to me for the answer. There's keepers closer to you than you think that hold the information you seek. Isn't that right, Rowan? Uh... What? She's a witch. Pitiful. You'll say anything to avoid having to talk to your lover about the secrets between you two. Whoa, whoa, whoa! What the hell are you on? We're not... lovers. Right, keep telling yourself that, but it's not a great decision on Levante's behalf to have an unwise king like yourself in charge, if that's the case. Wh what <laughs> What is she talking about? What do you know? She's a witch, Hunter. They fuck with you. With us. She's trying to start Discord. Wish I could say it were true, but hun, you sure know it's not. Solstice, I'm telling you right now, stop fucking with us and give us the damn answer we're hmm. looking for. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Solstice, I'm telling you right now, stop your bullshit. Uh, let go of me, you nitwit! Not until you fucking tell us what the hell is going on. Ask Demetrius! <laughs> Freak! Whoops. Demetrius actually has the answer. I mean, if he has a brain, that part's questionable, but still, he should know. And where is Demetrius? Mm, I don't know. Demetrius. I know you're in there. Mm. What do you want, you prick? Why are the Oglyphs here? I don't know what you're talking about. How am I supposed to believe that? You killed Sophia. You killed Terra. Keepers are dying every day because these monsters are overtaking this land. If you really care about this world, help me. Tell me what I'm supposed to do to make this stop. Get lost. You're wasting my time. 
Please, Demetrius. Just... I hope you burn in hell. Likewise. I'll make you burn for the crimes you've committed! Oh, better go chase your frantic princess. And Rowan, the past better be kept between us. Got it? Fuck you. Well, I'd consider that a success. Whatever, bitch. Don't forget that this is your fault. My fault? I did nothing. You're the one Fucking that- Fucking shut up! <sighs> My gosh, someone's having another temper tantrum. Didn't your mother ever tell you not to curse? No, for the love of Abaddon, Solstice, shut up! <laughs> 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 Well, that went just as terrible as I thought it would. Are you hiding something from me, Rowan? What? Are you hiding something from me? What? No! Of course not! Solstice is just a- A witch, I know. But that's the thing, actually. Witches usually know what they're talking about. They're smart. Hunter, she's just playing her cards to get herself out of there. I mean, can you really blame her? Hunter, please. Hunter, come on! Just answer me, What? what's wrong with you? Just stop it. Oh! <laughs> Hunter! That would help. Please. Hunter's in trouble. Uh, uh, sorry. It's fun. Rowan, can I ask you a question? What happened out there? Uh, I don't know. Rowan, I think you do, though. I can't tell you. But why? I don't know, but I know I just can't. <sighs> Look, Rowan, can I be honest with you? You need to open up about whatever it is you've bottled inside yourself. It's destroying all the relationships around you. And before long, you won't have anyone. Do you really want to ruin the connections you've made after the time it took for you to make them? I know something happened, Rowan. You won't tell me. And it's fine. You don't have to tell me. But please... Just think about what I've said. <sighs> Everything will be okay. Would you stop that? I'm not doing anything. Stop walking! Your chains are shriveling my ears and destroying my concentration!
It's not like there's anything else for me to do. You're lucky enough to have your own little setup. Well, if you hadn't killed as many keepers as you have, then maybe you would have been a little luckier. It's not like you're any better. Excuse me? I don't need to repeat myself. You know what, Demetrius? You really are the man-child I make you out to be. You refuse to acknowledge the fact that I'm stuck in here because of your heinous crimes. I would have never gotten in trouble for this shit if I hadn't met you. But now, now I'm stuck here. My life has wasted away behind these bars, and yet I still tried to help you. Even after I was put in here, thanks to you. You said 2030, Demetrius. But you're here now too. So it doesn't look like that'll be happening anytime soon. Thanks a lot. You owe me. But it's not like I'll ever get anything from you, because you've just so unfortunately trapped yourself in here with me. You're fortunate, in a way. Because if I could, I'd find a better way to break your neck than with just a rope. You bitch. And this is why you're the child. Because instead of trying to solve your problems, you just choose to harass everyone and call them names. Hence, what you've just done. If you would have just let me go the last time you visited me, we wouldn't be in this predicament. It's not like I had the damn keys with me. That could have been easily arranged before you came to see me. Or you could have found a day to come back with the keys. Ah, you really think I thought that far ahead? And you know what else? <sighs> what the hell are you gonna say now? You belong behind that door. Chained like the mutt you are. So you know what? Since I'm caged in here because of you, you don't have the right to complain. So lay your pathetic ass on the ground so I can have peace with my writing. Whatever, bitch. Hm. That's it. Uh, what now? <laughs> Demetrius, your last little visit might just be the key we need. It's always sighing, always breathing. Yeah, yeah, caveman.